We're going to talk about data and how our data moves. Whether we know it or not, it is moving. I'm going to do it. I'm going to start off by saying how we come we collect our data by GPS uh, points, mainly hydrants, uh, manholes, inlets, stuff like that. And we do quality control. We're engineers, so we're kind of anal, so we really look at the, at the accuracy of our data. We also get a lot of our data from uh, other sources, mostly the county in, in our case, and that's our line data. So we're talking about points and lines is what we're talking about. We use the line data and the point data. We create the maps, and that's where we go. Anyway, what do we use this data for? It was supposed to be, it was supposed to work, but it didn't. Anyway, so what do we use our data for? We use our data for creating all kinds of maps for our clients. Um, our clients are internal, external, mostly internal, and we create maps that have uh, parcel boundaries for the assessor for our, our community improvement. We do uh, boundary, neighborhood boundaries. We create utility maps for locates out in the field. We started doing that over the years. We've done that for about five years. Over the years, we've created a lot of data. <laughs> we've QA, QCR data, and we've, we've gone over and gone over and gone over. And we're engineers. We're engineers because as we create these maps, we want to make sure they're good maps. We want to make sure the maps are really good for everybody. Everybody's happy with our maps. And so we take a very close look at our maps. We take a very close look at our maps. And we, we looked at the data, we looked at the old maps, the new maps, and we said, hey, is this data good? Maybe it is? <laughs> what the heck are we going to do? So we called up our GIS consultant, and we said, hey, we got this data, but it's moving. They said, well, I don't know. <laughs> so anyway, they came back with a, with a set of procedures, and they said, hey, look, it's either going to be your source, your system, or your, your, your whatever else it was, <laughs> or your procedures. So we started putting all this stuff together and we started to look at our source. Uh, the first thing we looked at was the, was the source, the actual data. And was our data moving? So we looked at the old maps and compared it with the new maps and sure enough, we, we were amazed our data was moving. Now what do we do? We looked at maybe it was the I.O., the ignorant operator error. <laughs> the so we said, well, okay, maybe we're not doing this right. Maybe we got stuff too close to other stuff that shouldn't be there. And it won't work out the way we want it to work out. The third thing we ended up looking at was Okay, you made me talk fast, now I'm talking too fast. <laughs> the third thing we looked at was the system. And we looked at the, the system as, to, as far as the, the, the way our database is handled by the system we were using. What we found out was that actually the system does some rounding that we didn't know about. <laughs> so we were, we were quite surprised. So we got all the troops together. We said, okay, guys, we've got to come up with some kind, of, some kind of parameters as to how we can make this thing work. We came up with something that has to be relatively cheap because we don't have any money. It's got to be user friendly. And my co presenter, Bob, we got to make it bobable so he can handle it. <laughs> and again, we didn't quite, wasn't quite sure how this was going to work. So we called up our consultant. We said, Here's our parameters. Can you help us out? And they said, Well, ah, sure, no problem. <laughs> we're very good at this stuff because we're GIS consultants. So we, we gave them parameters. They went away and they took a look at what they could present us. And sure enough, they came back with a very simple solution that was. It didn't cost us any money, it was open source, it wasn't proprietary, so we owned the data, somebody else didn't own our data. We said we love this cheese. Yeah. <laughs> so then we said, okay, now that we got this system, let's start implementing it. So we took the, what else? Well, we took this system and we started to implement it. We started to put it in, we started to train our people. We got our GIS coordinator to, to learn how to manage the data. We tried to keep, make sure that the data didn't move, everything was going at the end. We think we made the right choice. <laughs> and our, as far as we know right now, our data is not moving, and we think everything's going the way it should be going, and we are very happy with the solution that we have. Thank you. Woo!